Happening now, students and alumni of Tennessee State University are celebrating homecoming. Yeah, this is a big weekend and an important event, especially for former football player Christian Abercrombie. News Channel 5's Brandon Marshall has been on campus all day as Amber Crumley and their family enjoy their time at their first homecoming. How are they doing, Brandon? Aurora, I can tell you it has been a special day for Christian and his family, especially after he suffered a life-altering head injury last fall during a football game. He says just being here today is a blessing. At Tennessee State University, thousands watched as the aristocrat of bands marched onto the field. No one more appreciative of the performance like Christian Abercrombie. The 21-year-old suffered a serious head injury during a TSU Vanderbilt football game last fall, narrowly killing him. During that week, I was texting my friends and family to get comfortable with God. After months of physical therapy, which he continues, many see him as a walking miracle, including his mom. Some didn't believe in the power of prayer, but I've talked to many that now they do believe in the power of prayer. Stacy Abercrombie says she never allowed her faith to waver throughout his recovery. I'm still, you know, trusting that God will, you know, restore him fully. Um, he's considered partially disabled right now, but I know things can change. She's thankful for the support from TSU and worldwide. And while her son continues physical therapy in Atlanta, she hopes people don't forget that life altering day here in Nashville. Coming back here is therapeutic. As a mother, I don't know if I'm taking it too personally. I just expect for um, the officials to take more responsibility. And when I say that, I, I expect more support. And I expect more support from TSU and even Vanderbilt. He was a student athlete here. Man, my mom, she's a very strong woman. She's, she's, she's my support, she's my support. Without her, I wouldn't be here right now. Since the age of five, football was Christian's life. He realizes he can no longer play, but believes he will coach one day. For now, he continues to walk in his blessings. Christian will lead tomorrow's homecoming parade as the special presidential grand marshal. And on a slighter sombering note, tomorrow during the TSU's homecoming game, there will be a moment of silence to remember student Ricky Smith, Ricky Scott, excuse me, who was shot and killed in Watson Hall. Live on Tennessee State University's campus, Brandon Marshall, News Channel 5.